the F-18 Super Hornet has been a cornerstone of air power for decades. Renowned for its versatility, strength, and combat resilience. But now, with groundbreaking upgrades in the Block 3 version, this aircraft is poised to change everything we know about air combat. These advancements come at a critical time when global threats are rising, and countries are seeking stronger, smarter, and more cost-effective solutions for their air forces. Boeing has made promises with this new variant, claiming it can take on the next generation of challenges like never before. But what makes the new F-18 Block 3 such a game-changer? And how different is it from other fighter jets? In this video, we'll dive deep into what sets the upgraded F-18 apart, exploring the cutting-edge technology, engineering innovations, and strategic importance of this formidable fighter jet. So stick around, you won't want to miss this. In the early 1970s, the US faced a rapidly shifting landscape in aerial warfare, and existing jets were specialized for singular roles, either excelling in dogfights or targeting ground assets, but rarely both. Northrop's YF-17 prototype provided a starting point, showing potential as a lightweight, agile fighter. With advancements by McDonnell Douglas, the F-18 Hornet emerged as a carrier-capable fighter, equipped for diverse missions and resilient and challenging naval environments. The multi-purpose design of the F-18 Hornet was groundbreaking. Being a twin-engine supersonic fighter, it could take off from aircraft carriers and carry out various tasks, including air support, strike operations, and escort and fleet defense missions. Commanders who required aircraft that could combat enemy fighters, defend naval fleets, and hit ground targets without switching platforms found it important due to its versatility on the battlefield. The Hornet's air-to-ground and air-to-air -air capabilities were further highlighted by its advanced avionics and digital fly-by-wire controls, which enhanced maneuverability and stability, especially during carrier landings. It also pioneered the use of composite materials with carbon fiber wings that improved durability while reducing weight, critical for carrier operations where compact, powerful aircraft are essential. The Hornet has shown to be effective in various combat situations throughout the years, including Operation Desert Storm, where it was assigned to duties involving air dominance, precision strikes, and interception. However, the Navy realized the Hornet needed to be upgraded to remain relevant as military technology and threats changed. In the 1990s, McDonnell Douglas, which had merged with Boeing in 1997, was tasked with building a more advanced variant, the F-18 Super Hornet. While retaining much of the Hornet's original spirit, the Super Hornet was redesigned to address the demands of modern warfare. From enhanced payload capacity and range to sophisticated radar systems and enhanced electronic warfare capabilities, the Super Hornet offered many improvements over the original F-18. With a 20% higher fuel capacity and a longer operational range, both crucial for prolonged missions, this model was larger. Following the merger, Boeing's leadership sped up these developments, allowing for a more efficient production and maintenance procedure that decreased operating costs and improved dependability. The Super Hornet's launch increased its importance on the international scene by enabling improved interoperability with other American and partner military forces. Today, the F-18's legacy is about to continue through the Block 3 upgrades, ensuring it remains at the forefront of military aviation. The nature of warfare has evolved dramatically, with modern conflicts demanding far more from fighter jets than just speed and firepower. Traditional air-to-air -air dogfighting, once the pinnacle of fighter jet combat, is now just one piece of a complex tactical landscape. Today's jets must perform a diverse array of missions, from electronic warfare and reconnaissance to precision strikes and close air support. To function well in various settings, including contested airspaces full of sophisticated anti-aircraft weapons, they must be adaptable. Because jets like the F-18 Super Hornet must adjust to these many duties and remain effective against new threats, this shift has increased the requirements for ongoing upgrades. Geopolitical tensions have further highlighted the need for adaptable, robust fighter aircraft. With the rise of formidable military forces like China and Russia, the United States and its allies face an increasingly sophisticated set of aerial adversaries. China's J-20 Mighty Dragon and Russia's Su-57 Felon represent the newest in stealth and fifth-generation fighter technology. These jets are designed with advanced radars, stealth capabilities, and electronic warfare systems providing them with significant advantages in both offensive and defensive operations. In addition, China's rapid production capability mean that the J-20 could potentially flood contested regions, presenting a serious threat to American and allied forces. 
This competitive landscape has driven the enhancements of the F-18 Super Hornet, especially with the latest Block 3 upgrades. While the Super Hornet was initially developed as a fourth generation fighter, the Block 3 modifications will give it capabilities that can compete with fifth generation jets in specific mission areas. Advanced radar systems, extended range, enhanced situational awareness, and improved electronic warfare abilities allow the Super Hornet to maintain an edge despite the age of its underlying design. Moreover, while stealth remains a central advantage for competitors like the F-35 and F-18, the F-18's versatility and lower maintenance cost make it a more feasible option for varied mission demands, particularly where stealth is not paramount. Technological advancements are also driving the need for upgrades. The rapid evolution of radar, sensor fusion, and artificial intelligence has redefined what a smart fighter jet should be. For the F-18 Super Hornet, the latest avionics and radar systems enable it to detect threats from greater distances, track multiple targets, and operate in electronically contested environments. Enhanced data links and network capabilities also make it easier for the Super Hornet to work alongside unmanned aircraft, increasing its tactical options. As threats grow more diverse and interconnected, these systems are critical for maintaining air superiority. The F-18 must provide more than just firepower in a world where enemies are deploying advanced aircraft with stealth and electronic warfare capabilities. To do this, the fighter jet needs the Block 3 Super Hornet upgrade, which combines cutting-edge technology with operational adaptability to carry out a variety of missions at a reasonable cost. This balance between capability and adaptability has helped the F-18 remain competitive in a world of rapidly advancing fighter jets ensuring that it can counter threats from sophisticated rivals like the J-20 and Su-57 while fulfilling the U.S. Navy's evolving mission requirements. The F-18 Super Hornet Block 3 upgrade has several improvements intended to increase its longevity, improve performance, and prepare it for the complex battlefield of today. In addition to enhancing the Super Hornet's combat capabilities, the Block 3 upgrade gets it ready to fly alongside fifth-generation aircraft like the F-35, one of the most impactful upgrades is the increase in structural durability, extending the Super Hornet's lifespan from 6,000 to an impressive 10,000 flight hours. This is achieved through a combination of refined design and stronger materials, ensuring that the fighter jet can serve for decades. Boeing has also introduced structural streamlining that reduces parts by approximately 42%, which lowers maintenance costs and improves operational efficiency. With a wingspan of nearly 45 feet and a length of about 60 feet, the Block 3 is larger than previous F-18 models, providing the extra space needed to incorporate advanced systems while retaining the agility and performance that have defined the Super Hornet. The Block 3 Super Hornet is powered by two General Electric F-414 engines, each capable of delivering substantial thrust for high-speed and high-altitude operations. It can reach speeds up to Mach 1.6 or around 1200 miles per hour at optimal altitude. This speed allows it to close in on targets quickly and engage or disengage effectively in dynamic combat scenarios. The aircraft's maximum takeoff weight is roughly 66,000 pounds, allowing it to carry extensive payloads without sacrificing speed or maneuverability. The addition of conformal fuel tanks, sleek aerodynamically integrated tanks on the fuselage, extends its range by over 300 miles, offering a combat radius of around 600 miles. This increase in range is crucial for missions requiring extended loiter time or operations in remote areas where refueling might not be immediately available. The APG-79 AESA radar, a high-performance radar that greatly enhances detection and tracking capabilities, is part of the Block 3's avionics package. With improved situational awareness thanks to the system, pilots can detect and interact with targets farther away while reducing the likelihood that hostile systems will notice them. Pilots can also easily conduct complex missions with numerous targets and various mission types thanks to the sophisticated cockpit configuration, which features huge touchscreens and an advanced CPU for mission management. With all of these improvements, the Block 3 Super Hornet is now a powerful and adaptable aircraft that can deliver a fearsome combination of speed, endurance, and weaponry. The General Electric F-414 engines, along with the aircraft's streamlined design and enhanced range, make it one of the most powerful and adaptable jets in service today. Fully prepared to meet the demands of modern warfare, these changes solidify its role as a cornerstone of the U.S. Navy's air power and make it an attractive choice for allied forces around the world. Now we want to hear from you. What is your take on the upgraded F-18 Super Hornet? Do you think it has what it takes to shape the future of air combat? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this breakdown, be sure to give the video a thumbs up 
and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insights into the latest military tech. Until next time, stay tuned and stay informed.